All right, so here we go. We've got two nights down in Chicago. GD50, Celebration, Fare Thee Well. You know all the names by now. We've got hashtags. We've got it all. They retire tomorrow night, though, so don't get too attached, people. Shakedown Street is how it got started tonight. And the crowd, you could hear, I was listening on Sirius again tonight on the Dead Channel. The crowd noise coming through the radio. The place must have been where they, did they, are they measuring the Richter scale in Chicago? That might have been technically an earthquake. Liberty had to give the nod of the hat to 4th of July, obviously. That was actually one of the highlights of the first set for me. See, then we got Standing on the Moon, sung by Trey. Then a nice little run here of fan favorites. Me and my uncle, Tennessee Jed, Cumberland Blues, Little Red Rooster, Friend of the Devil. And then they closed the first set with Deal. Started strong with Shakedown and Liberty with some jamming. In strong with Deal with some jamming. I'm thinking, all right, here we go. Another big night. Even got Jeff Comenti involved early on with some jams. Hornsby still on the back burner for now. But Bruce getting involved in the second set, and that's where we're going to head right now. Let's see here. Got some, okay, along with all the fan favorites in the first set, they went completely the other way in the second set. Well, I shouldn't say these aren't fan favorites. They were just a little more obscure, I guess. Birdsong, Golden Road, Jer, Lost Sailor. I guess I, like I didn't say, I'm not webcasting. They said Mickey had on the Lost Sailor hat. I don't know if it's a Lost Sailor hat, but it's a Sailor cap. Saint Circumstance, and then West L.A. Fade Away. There he is. There's Bruce Hornsby. All right. Getting Bruce involved on the vocals, anyhow. Foolish Heart. Last night, Drums in Space. You know, if you watched the video last night, I finally said, all right, thumbs up. Not only was it solid, it led to a solid set. Kind of was the uh, beginning of something big, but tonight came late in the set. Drums was pretty cool. Space, however, I thought, you know, just kind of, a little bit too spacey for me, which led to Stella Blue getting Comenti involved again, at least. They tried to bring it back up, though, but that was a chill fucking 25-minute run right there. Pretty much laid me out, but one more Saturday night trying to bring it back. Ended it strong. All right, all right, here we go. It's like, that's like, they're what, they're Julius, their character's hero, perhaps. U.S. Blues was the encore. And, of course, Phil reminding everybody that death is inevitable. With the donor wrap. Be an organ donor, people. So that pretty much does it, you know? I was thinking at some point I wrote down here, yeah. I did take a few notes tonight, believe it or not. I don't know why. But the note says here, during drums and space, I was high as shit, of course. Still slightly am. But I'm just sitting there thinking, man, these two dudes, there's only two of them playing in a fucking football stadium full of fans. And there's just two of them. And it's like... It's not a little club. It's a fucking football stadium full. Just two dudes. I mean, did they ever just look around like, Jesus fucking Christ, man. We're, you know, 50 years ago, we're just playing football. Nah, you know, I don't know how small it was when they started. 